What's going on everybody? This is David with Tech Tips and we're here to talk about how to properly remove an iPhone 4 4S battery. We've had a lot of questions lately of how to remove the battery without causing damage to the board. Um, it all really generally has to do with what tools you're using and I prefer to use the plastic sponge over the metal sponge tool. Um, the reason that is is because the metal tool can actually cause damage to the board by knocking circuitry off. First thing is first you want to remove the screws off of the connector. Next what you want to do is take your plastic pick. You don't really have to touch the board in this particular situation. Once you have the connector up you want to remove any additional hardware I'd like to use a metal pick to pry up on the battery you want to make sure not to puncture it so you want to get in there and gently pull um, and you'll hear the adhesive come up when you're when you're prying that up and don't be afraid to use your you know get your fingers in there and pull pull as well this is a general area where your components and your um, and your circuits are on the iPhone 4 and the 4s you want to avoid that that general area Appreciate you guys stopping by. Thanks a lot.